Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hollywood Shono here, about to give you the Justice God's Among Us video. As you can see here, we are at Battle 35, which has Prison Superman in it. I would have had Battle 34, however, the recording is botched up. So we are going to fight Gold Doomsday, Black Adam, as well as Batman with my best three characters. We are actually going to try one attempt on Prison Superman without Black Adam to see if it is possible to kill him without promoted gold cards. So when I do that fight, I will probably bring in one of my random level 20 cards and Black Adam is chipping away at Doomsday's life. That's pretty much swipe away talking here. So gotta watch for the ultimate. Let's off only 624, not Brock, but Black Adam will take it. So we are working on the third bar as Gold Black Adam is in and Lightning goes off, so Lightning is gone. We're gonna launch a Tap Adam. And Gold Black Adam will be eliminated. After this, we're gonna get Batman in for a little break. Explosive battering, so Batman does like himself. Now, when Doomsday tags back in, we have to be careful not to eat a special because. He will get 50% of his life back, however, there's a stun by Batman, so we're going to get off the Dark Knight on Batman. And that should do about half of Batman's life. And we have to watch for Doomsday to tag in, so got to make sure to block right away, 48.7. So Prison Superman has two bars, so we're going to work on the third bar. Doomsday is low on health, and nothing Black Adam can't handle. So we're going to go off the Kryptonite Smash, and then we're going to make sure to try to block right away, and then tag in Black Adam, who can take some hits. So very important when you're fighting Doomsday, is Prison Superman did not go down, Black Adam is in. Earthshake for almost 7,000 damage does not kill Black Adam. So explosive battering is... You like this. Black Adam might actually go down. No, he does not. He manages to survive. Somebody finally almost beat Black Adam. And there is the victory. So, 8,220 XP. Batman is now level 22. Gaining 82 damage and 231 health. 1,090 credits for the first fight. So, in the second battle, we have Insurgency Batman, Harley Quinn, and the Joker. So, another fight that should be rather interesting. And like I said, in the third fight, we're going to sub Black Adam out. Begin. Okay, so we are dealing with Batman. As Harley Quinn and the Joker are sitting sidelines. Black Adam is at one bar, close to Batarang is blocked. So Batman is getting worn down. Now, if Harley Quinn tags in, we're going to save Black Adam and Tenth Adam for the Joker, as the Joker does come in. Seeing as Harley Quinn does have a lot less life than the Joker, so we are going to get up to three bars. And off goes a Tef Adam. So the Joker will be eliminated. So Batman is in. We are going to actually put our own Batman in so we can build up his meter to go take out a good chunk of Harley Quinn's life, so Batman is getting whittled away. He'll probably tag out fairly soon. He's also bad rank for about 900. So we do have the three bars for the Dark Knight. Prison Superman is at two bars. He's working towards three, so it'll pretty much be a one, two, three. So just working over Batman, doing the shit. Close to bad rank for about 440 block. And this is taking a little bit longer than I had hoped, so we're gonna get Black Adam in to go finish off Batman. He had a lot more life than I thought, and Harley Quinn is in, so top top for a thousand hits. And Prison Superman's gonna get off his Kryptonite Smash, followed by a Dark Knight if Harley Quinn has any more life, and then we're just gonna mop up on the rest of Batman's life. So, 4,725 damage. Batman actually tags back in, which I don't understand. So Batman is going to launch Explosive Batarang for about 1,200. And we are going to go finish off Batman and immediately launch the Dark Knight. On to Harley Quinn, and this fight will be over. So as you can see here, not too bad. 4,950 damage for the knockout. 
So, 8,240 XP. And 1,110 credits. So now we are dealing with Prison Superman, who has 26,640 health. As I said, we are going to try to actually bring in somebody else, so... I'm actually going to choose... Harley Quinn, because that's a 10% damage boost. Oh, took the wrong character out. Batman. So if this lineup fails, we are going to have Black Adam just mop up Superman. But we're going to try this once and see how it goes. Just to give my viewers a chance to see what Prison Superman is like without a overpowered gold card. So, as you can see, Batman is currently building up his bar. We're going to get Harley Quinn in for a little bit. Just to kind of give people a breather in so Harley Quinn can take some hits. Because obviously not going to be able to do so much. And Flying Punch even blocks his knockout. So, as you can see, Prison Superman does do a decent amount of damage. So, even block the upper block for the damage. And Prison Superman... Launching another flank punch for only 13, 18. That one did considerably less damage. So we're going to get Batman in. He's at two bars. And he ate a double punch for about 1,600. And melee down for about 750. So we got one bar. Eats the punch. Now he's going to be able to get off, hopefully, the Dark Knight. Yes, he is. So off goes the Dark Knight. And that is about 5,000 damage. Now the main thing to watch for with Prison Superman is he does have a health regen, which does about 40% of his life, so you probably don't want to do what I do and get off two specials in a row because now his super health is going to tick off and he'll have pretty close to a full life bar. So I do not see his super health going off yet though. And then good. There's his super health. So as you can see, his health is uh, ramping right up there. He's at about three quarters of his life, two thirds of his life. So fairly academic here. Not a whole lot we can do. So Batman's got one bar. He gets knocked out. And very unlikely we're going to be able to survive prison superhuman. So we are going to eat flying punch, and he gets knocked out. So as you can see. With Black Adam in the fight, it would be very easily doable. However, without, it's a little trickier. So we are going to actually put in Black Adam. Black Adam and we are going to put in the Joker. the Joker. And pretty much Black Adam is going to go solo Superman by himself. So we're going to give this a tr attempt and see if Prison Superman can actually Begin. do anything. Now the important thing here is I do have other characters that can attack to disrupt the super health. So we got Black Adam in here, and Prison Superman is taking more damage than Black Adam currently. So punch is coming, 1350 damage, not a big deal. Another punch should be coming shortly, as Black Adam is at two bars. So, 1800 damage. And as you can see here, his super health has not gone off yet. Black Adam's Teth Adam with Harley Quinn in the lineup does 20,000 damage, so... We're going to get that off and wipe out Prison Superman quickly before he can even get his super health off. So as you can see, there is the quick victory by using Teth Adam to overkill Black or Prison Superman before he can get his health regen off. So I received one energy card, two energy cards, three energy cards, four energy cards, 22,000 260 credits and as you can see battle 35 is completed i have successfully opened the final tier so if you like this little video of one shotting battle 35 as well as seeing what happens when you don't use a promoted gold card against black adam please give this video a like rating comment subscribe share this video amongst your friends and as a favorite check out my other injustice gods among its videos simpsons tapped out WWE 13, Call of Duty Black Ops 2, God of War Ascension, Diablo 3, StarCraft 2, yada yada yada, and have a wonderful day, kids.